Hello everyone, this is Ange. Welcome to another episode of the Visual Novel Monthly Recap. This is a video series where I highlight news related to major visual novel releases and the community for each month. In this video, I'll highlight anything that happened in September of 2020. Let's get started. Alka Translations released their monthly status update at the beginning of September. While Summer Pocket's Reflection Blue is fully translated, there's still plenty of work to be done like editing and testing. Also, there's confirmation that Crude Wafter is going to be resuming progress soon. Ion Ion Games is working with Sekai Project and Regista to bring over a Switch port for Root Double in English. Ninetale has started their Kickstarter for Venus Blood Hollow. As of this recording, they've already passed their original goal and over half their stretch goals. Manga Gamer released a visual novel called Wanyan a la Mode. If you're into visual novels with animal girls like Nekopara, this visual novel may be for you. Alka Translations released a version 1.1 patch for the Sky Full of Stars Fine Days translation. This patch will fix some typos and add some other UI improvements. I had a personal hand in proofreading, so hopefully people interested in reading this fandus can get this patch before reading. The 2020 Manga Gamer licensing series results have finally been fully released. Some interesting results were that most responders were in the 18 to 24 age range, people tended to do lots of research before making a purchase, and that voice acting isn't actually a significant concern outside version differences. The top 15 license requests can be seen in this video. Karano Shoujo 3 has been announced and is planning to release soon in Japan. Hopefully, it shouldn't be too long before Manga Gamer picks it up to license it in English. An official website for the Muv Love Alternative anime adaptation is up. As of now, it appears to be almost a month until we'll see actual content in there though. Deposauce's the website temporarily went down due to its previous e-commerce processor banning it without warning. They're now back up on a self-host, but with a somewhat more basic look on the site. For those who use VNDV, you now have the ability to write reviews. Currently, you can write 5 reviews a day, and you have the option to write a mini review with an 800 character maximum, as well as a full review that has to be at least 1000 characters. Manga Gamer released a brand new Italian translation for the House and Fata Morgana. If you're most comfortable reading in Italian, be sure to check out this translation of a very popular visual novel. Front Wing released their third game in their Local Love series called My Pure Priestess. It features Yachio, and you can buy it on either Jast or Faku. There is new DLC for the girls' love visual novel, Highway Blossoms. It's a brand new story and scenario with multiple viewpoints. Some sections follow Amber and Marina, while some sections follow Tess. Additionally, there are certain parts where you can choose to read from Amber or Marina's point of view. There is a fan translation release for another console-only Higurashi chapter, Miyotsukushi Uda. The patch requires a copy of Chapter 4, Himatsubushi. The Steam version, the GOG version, and the version directly from Manga Gamer's website are all supported. Follow the instructions on the 07th mod wiki to get everything you need. And that is it for September of 2020. As always, if you have any feedback, positive or negative, feel free to leave a comment below in this video or one of my social medias. See you all next month.